Okay, that felt good, that felt good, that felt good. Yeah! Hey guys, what is up? Welcome to the channel for another video. Today is gonna be day four on bike number three of trying to learn how to friggin' wheelie. We've been out here three times before. If you guys wanna check out the playlist, it should be linked down below or up in the corner. But yeah, other than that, let's uh, let's go jump into it. I've been trying to learn how to wheelie. Been a slow progression, but I feel like I'm finally getting somewhere. Now we're changing out bikes once again. This time we got the KLX 140 RF. Now what makes this different than the last two bikes? The first bike we started on was the Apollo. RFZ. <laughs> and then we went over and we swapped over to the XR100. And now we're here on the KLX 140RF. Now what's different between those three bikes that we just named is the Apollo RFZ had a small wheel set, which made it a bit more, I don't know, tippy, really quickly tippy back and forth. Then we hopped on the XR100 that had a 19 inch front tire and a 16 inch rear tire, a little bit larger than the RFZ. And that one felt pretty stable up at the right, right angle. The issue with the XR and trying to learn how to wheelie with it is that it had drum brake and the rear drum brake really, really sucked and it was not sensitive at all so I'd bring the bike up and then when I went to try and hit the brake pedal to bring it back down you'd press the brake pedal and it's too late you've already looped out and you're on your ass so hopefully today with the KLX 140 RF it's a little bit heavier than both the bikes we had previously been trying it with so there's that to take into consideration a little bit heavier a little bit longer of a wheelbase you're gonna have to snap it more to get the thing to pop up and uh yeah a little bit bigger wheel set as well this is 21 inch front and 18 inch rear I don't know how it's gonna go or how much easier or harder it's gonna be but I I guess let's just jump into it and see how it goes. All right, so if you guys have watched the last three episodes, you'd know where we kind of got to last time. We're still learning, boys. We are still learning. I am still trying to get the concept out. It's a little bit different. This thing, once again, we got a bent brake lever, which doesn't help, but at least this one I can, uh, it's sensitive enough. So this one, I'm just trying to figure out how to get it up far enough. Let's give her a try. It's also got a bit taller of a first gear, so it's a bit harder in that regard. Gotta get her up higher. Oh, this one's gonna be tough. All right, there we got it a little bit high enough. This is the part that's got a little bit of a slant to the hill, which is gonna help us. Still gotta get it up though. This is our very first time trying to wheelie this bike. We just picked it up a little while ago. I've never even tried. These are literally my first attempts. Feels like we're just spinning out, but I'm not sure. See, but I want to keep it slow and controlled. And not do that. And I got to remember to, you know, obviously try and keep your foot on that brake, but man, it's hard. And not that much gas, because we just spin. That was all right. Oh, this one's going to be a lot harder than the XR, I'll tell you that much. Go down, we'll give her another shot. Yeah, this one's a lot harder. The front end's a lot heavier. So you gotta snap the throttle quite a bit more. And it doesn't help that we're on like loose ground. And this thing got quite a torquey low gear. So if you let up too much snap, it just spins. Woo! Okay, okay. Ah, bugger. Lots more practice still needed. Feels good, but it's uncontrolled and we're not controlling it. And then our feet come off the peg. Gotta stay on the pegs to stay in control. I just want to be able to wheelie so bad. Oh, this one's so much harder. into the woods okay i think i got i need to snap the claw harder and not slide and not like slip it as much as i was i need a more of a dump more dumpy dump less slippy slip i'll also be curious if i uh, swap out the gearing and do a little bit more of a short gearing in this if it would help or not but try a bit more of a dump snap see but i'm having troubles keeping that foot on 
into the woods. Wonder if no, but you want to be lean back. You, you can't be lean. You need to be straight arm when you come back. <laughs> that was our longest, but sketchy. I need to get the point so I can rock it back and forth. Cause right now I get up, I get the front end up and then it gets up high and then my foot comes off the peg and then I'm just kind of sitting there hanging on. Okay, that felt good, that felt good, that felt good. Oh, see that was, that was it, that was money. We just needed to keep our foot so we could touch the brake there. Yes, okay, this is feeling decent. This is feeling okay, this is feeling okay. Keep with that, try not to just death grip it to hell. This is gonna be a hard journey, boys. I give so much props. I say this every time, but I give it so much props to the guys that are popping those fat wheelies, going like 60, 80 down the highways, man. Like dragon fender and hand drags and stuff. It's crazy. Maybe, I wonder if we go look for like a steeper hill, find one that's got way more angle on it and see if we can do that there. We might, might just go do that after this run. Okay. Oh, I just want it so bad. Oh, it's so friggin' hard. Yeah, we're, let's go find a steeper hill to try this on. I think a steeper hill is really gonna help us out at getting it up there without like, I don't know. I just think it's gonna help. Everyone says it helps. So let's go find a steeper hill to try this at. All right, got all our gear. Let's go find a big hill, boys. Let's see what we can find that'll help us get the front end up. And primar primarily something that's not just totally covered in this loose shaly rock that's, well, pretty slippery. But beggars can't be choosers, I guess, right? Uh, it looks like there's no hills this way at all. I know we were saying we were looking for another hill, but damn, I just found this spot. Just kind of like came up here, just looking like, you can see we rode all the way up to the top of this like mountain here. And uh, I mean, just look at it. It's just freaking gorgeous. I might just have lunch here and just chill for a minute, you know? It's just so beauty. You don't see this kind of stuff every day, you know? Pretty blessed to be able to have the ocean out there, just like looking as beauty as it does today, right in the valley. Beautiful sunny day, no clouds over here. Yeah, it's pretty sick, man. Might just have lunch. Woo, okay, I like this hill. I think we found a pretty good hill right here. Yeah, okay, I like this hill. This top part's a little rocky, but. I know we're here to do wheelies, but I just found this new trail while I was just like up here riding around looking for a spot. So I can't really turn it down. I want to see where it goes. Let's find out. See if we got any cool obstacles or stuff in here. I just I just came across this and I, I just want to see where it comes out. I just love me some new trails. Woo! Up on the bedrock. Let's go. Woo! Oh wow, and then it goes down. Okay, this is cool. That'd be a good hill climb coming up that way. Yeah, let's see where this trail goes. Looks like it's gonna be uh, exciting. Woohoo! Woohoo! Yeah, no idea where this does end up going. So, also looks like it goes that way. I think we needed to come do some exploring here, boys. It looks like there's way too much good stuff right around here. And this goes down here. Woo! Go right down the, whoa. Lots of traction today. Everything's dry. Just no idea where we're going or where we're turning. Woo! Okay, then a hard right. Kind of hard too when I got all this camera gear, like a big ass tripod and stuff, poking me in the back of the head when you're riding these little trails. Oh, oh my. Wow, okay. Jump up the ledge and then we'll probably cuff her right, I think. I don't know. I guess, uh, I guess we're gonna find out. It's like so. And then up there or over here. Let's try this one. Just because we're so low. And then down over here. And it goes somewhere over here, so let's go down her. 
no idea what we're really gonna get ourselves into here, but I'm okay with that. I like the exploration. <laughs> I, this is this is cool. I did not know this was here. Okay, it's kind of soft. Yeah, it's a little soft. Nothing the KLX can't handle though. And then up here, instead of the sissy line, we'll go right up the knoll. Let's try it. I think we can do this. Okay, maybe we bit off more than we can chew there with all our bag and heavy bag and shit. Hell yeah. Then we're going down into something here. Woo! That was steep down. What the heck are we gonna get into over here? Up here? <laughs> I'm loving this, boys. I'm loving this. Oh, I just wanna know where this comes out because this will be a sick one if it leads like where the entrance is that we get in from this would be a great warm-up trail okay then over here and into the trees interesting and up we go ow something smashed my foot and this is why we wear riding boy boots boys No way! That's right friggin' there. Wow, and right into the trees. Oh, this is dope. Now to go find that other half a section. I'm gonna go see where that one goes to. This is the turn here. This is what we were looking at. This one looks a bit more uh, like less developed, less ridden. Maybe they're just in the beginning of like marking this one out. More pink ribbon, more pink ribbon. Oh, this does just look like a shortcut. Well, that was an absolute blast of a day. We didn't quite get to do as many wheelies as I wanted to, but I found this new sick trail, which I'm super stoked on. Next time we come out, we're definitely gonna spend some more time on a better hill to do some wheelies. But if you guys enjoyed today's video, make sure you guys leave a like down below, comment any questions you got, click subscribe so you guys don't miss out on any of our future videos. Make sure you guys ring that bell notification as well while you're there. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.